So we're back again, uh, this time for stage two. Uh, this time we're going to be seeing just about nearly all of the enemies, uh, enemy types uh, coming into the game. So we're going to go ahead and run over here, pick up this knife, and if any of these enemies come down, oops, didn't get it. No, we didn't get it, but the best time to attack the martial artists is when they go for their uh, kick move. But yeah, we, we don't want to be anywhere near that explosion when they uh, throw the dynamite. Alright, that takes care of the martial artist. You don't have to fight the bullet here, but it does pay to get rid of some enemies. Unfortunately, I made the mistake of trying to attack that uh, martial artist. You do not want to be doing that like I just did. It's kind of a force of habit sometimes. But if enemies do decide to come run after you, uh, you can always use the stationary jump to um, attack to pretty much uh, avoid getting hit, and you're, you will be safe. So now we're coming up to the Arnolds. Arnolds and Giganes, which we'll see in uh, Stage 3, are pretty much the strong guys, and they pretty much hit pretty hard, just like everything else. Uh, they do have a snap suplex, which uh, hits pretty hard. So you want to be very careful when uh, fighting any of these guys, because uh, they're pretty easy to beat up, but at the same time, they're also... They can also deal a ton of damage. So now we're coming up to Stage 2. You can do this special right there that hits just about every one of these enemies. We do have a warrior and a skinny coming out. Got very lucky there. Yeah, you can attack this skinny right before he comes out. Ooh, got very lucky there. Normally you don't usually group enemies together in uh, Rival Turf. But most of these enemies right there are pretty easy. Anyway, wait for these martial artists to come out, do the special. You can sometimes get them again. I went ahead and did a third one just to be safe and get rid of that, um... Get rid of that, uh, Kato right there. Or I should say Goro. Ooh, so this is the snap suplex I was talking about. That does massive amount of damage and that almost guarantees, uh... Health, uh, losing all your health right there. So, anyway, once you beat up all these enemies, you go to the parking lot, the final area for stage two. Yeah, just try to do the best you can to mash the attack buttons so that uh, they don't break your chain combo. too close there. Ooh, got lucky. And that was not one. That was not lucky. Normally I have way better luck with this. <laughs> so yeah, you can uh, intercept this skinny right there on this plane. Uh, we do have uh, Kato coming on with some weaker enemies. Just make sure you mash attack buttons. And if you're not careful, just make sure you do stationary jumps, force them to uh, play to your uh, play to your request rather than theirs. Yeah, you went for that long range spin kick. It doesn't deal nearly as much damage, but the short range one one does. So yeah, we're going to lose another uh, life there, but that's uh, okay. Because uh, we're not doing speed runs, we're just mostly focusing on guides. So basically, once you get done, done with the dingoes, the uh, skinnies are the only ones left. Uh, they're kind of very difficult to approach, no thanks to the uh, to their kicks. So yeah, we're coming up to uh, Sledge. Uh, basically, he's pretty easy to deal with. Uh, he only goes for the... Um, 
uh, Airhawk, which is, he calls for his car. And summons two bullets, so uh, get rid of them. Um, basically what you want to do is you want to do this, but I don't get the right setup. Basically you can go like this, so when you get close to the end... But yeah, that, uh, that overhead uh, smash attack uh, will do a whole lot of damage. But basically what you want to do is to do that stun loop and keep them uh, in position right there. So that pretty much concludes uh, uh, stage two. But all you have to do is just make sure you're in the upper planes when um, Sledge calls for the um, car. But anyway, uh, he's pretty easy to deal with overall. So yeah, I'm going to take a small break, get some water, and I will cover stage three next.